Hi there, Dan Lipkus. He uh, changed our whole plant deal around this year. Uh, bought a little bigger planter at a 24 row high speed. I had a 16 row high speed before, but uh, just as I'm getting older, trying to get done a little quicker and trying to simplify things a little bit. So I want to show you some of the things that are different on this planter and things that are a little new or maybe you haven't seen before. So um, a lot of planters you buy if they don't have a liquid system on and you have to set that up. So on this planter, on my, if you want to call it three, three inches out, it's not three, three below. I'm putting fertilizer on top of the ground with this planter and we are, we're doing it with Martin Till's um, closing system. So we just wide down, actually Steve Martin designed these for me um, so we could lay the fertilizer in a band on top. Now, I believe putting it in the ground is better, but when you're putting it in the ground, you also have a lot of wear issues. Uh, it doesn't matter what system you're using. Uh, we tend to get a rain fairly often around planting time. In fact, that's why we're stopped now you know, rain. And with 32% sulfur and some of these other things, rain will take that right down. So um, even though it's possibly not the best scenario, but it's still a really good scenario. So that's the way I've tried to do that. So in combination with Martins with their closing systems, and they got their two-stage closing system here, that's this wheel running behind uh, their crushers, is what I've noticed about this is that it really does a nice job, two different things. If you're not quite closing well, this will finish closing, or if you're kind of clotty, which we had a little bit of that, these actually will mash the clods up pretty good and leave, uh, leave your seed furrowing uh, everything looking better and doing a better job getting all the air pockets out. So there's the closing system, fertilizer delivery, which we're coming down and bringing it right alongside the row on each side. And that is basically the fertilizer system is powered by Surefire's liquid shift system. And you know, that's a pump that's running off hydraulically driven pump that as I drop uh, down and use our centrifugal fans, our CCS fans, that's that same system powers this pump. So it's not drawing a lot of oil from the system. So the way that system has been working is it's called a liquid shift. So on a high speed planter, you are running a lot of different speeds a lot of different times, uh, depending on your condition. So it's usually between five and 10, but that's a big range, you know, when you're putting out, with this we're putting out 15 gallons per acre. So your pressures will vary greatly. And it's hard to come up with something that, for the right pressures to get that entire range. So what, uh, Surefire has done is it's something called their liquid shift. And what that is is up here, as you can see, these systems will shift from a bigger line to a smaller line as the pressures are needed. So it can keep you kind of in that right pressure range. Or if you're really hauling the mail, going like heck, uh, it can, it'll open both, you know, to drop your pressures down. Uh, keep them in that sustainable range. So we've got we've got that with the uh, Surefire liquid system. Now also from them, I got this is pretty cool. So come on over here. 